I see y'all still falling for the okie doke from the mass media. I'm not going to take credit for this. My man TJ on Instagram kind of shared this, but I'm going to sum it up. Uh, the HB314 bill, the first thing I saw was a bunch of white men from the state senate in Alabama. This is the blame for all of this, but let me give you a little knowledge. HB314 was drafted in the Alabama House of Representatives before it made it to the state senate of Alabama. It was voted on and passed 74 to 3 and handed off. There are 18 women in Alabama House of Reps, 18 women, 11 are Democrats. Of those 11 Democrats who are women, 11 are African-American. So at minimum, if the three that voted against it were black women, eight black Democrats who so happen to be black women voted for it. Makes you wonder why. The governor that is a woman signed it into law. Makes you wonder, right? But even more importantly, it was, it was at least 15 out of 18 women who voted yes for the bill. I beg of you to vote locally. These are your politicians that you put into office at a local level, at a grassroots ground level. And this could happen in any state. You just don't know. But the fact is, don't try and pass everything off as this big, big race issue all the time when it's way more deeper than that. You don't know why these people put this into law or what their motivation for it was. But knowledge is power. Food for thought. Thank <laughs> you.